Hi everybody, I'm Steve and welcome back to Route 7 Railway. This video is a short one, just showing you a few clips about a little trip I took on Monday to go and see Pete Waterman's uh, layout at Chester Cathedral. Excellent stuff, massive layout. It's about 60, 70 foot long with a, a 60, 70 foot scenic area with long runs for the trains and a huge um, fiddle yard with loads of rolling stock on it and it was really interesting. And no sooner as I walked through the door, I bumped into somebody who was one of the inspirations of mine of getting back into the hobby after 40, 50 years plus out of it. And that was uh, Richard of New Junction and Mike, both of now Hornby magazine. They were there doing their, going to be taking pictures. And I've got to say, I couldn't, you couldn't have wished for them two friendlier guys. We had a good old chat about any, anything and everything to do with the, the layout itself, the cathedral, the, tra the trains, model train, modeling in general, and, and my layout even. And he, Richard even subscribed to my channel. How cool is that? I was very pleased. Really nice fellas. So a nice big shout out to them for making me uh, welcome. And I also bumped into uh, Alan from Dragon Junction, or Dragon Junction Mark II to be exact. It was really nice to see him and his wife there with his grandson, who was doing his filming for him. Good lad. Um, so we took a, uh, so we took a few selfies and uh, and a few pictures with the people there, and even I even got a picture with Pete Waterman. Again, he was really busy, uh, but took the time out to take pictures with me and other people there, which was really nice. Um, the whole thing was re really pleasant day out. So let's, without further ado, let's get onto the video, and so you can see. Oh, by the way. I'm asking a few questions during this video. I expect a bit of thunder maybe, and maybe a bit of lightning, because it's been off and on all day, and it's just started again. There'll be a few questions in this video, and I hope you can answer them, put the answers and messages to me uh, connected with this video. For those that get the questions right, we'll go into a draw and do a little bit of a giveaway. Haven't realized what the prize is yet, that's gonna be a surprise. It won't be much, but it's just a nice little thank you for uh, for me getting over 300 subscribers can't believe it and um, and i hope you enjoy the video so speak to you soon bye bye well, here's my transport for wales train fleet number 175003 
Hello again. Well, wasn't that great? What I've done there, I, like Alan from Dragon Junction, I've cut out a lot of the filming and I haven't put a lot of shots into that video. So I don't spoil it for you uh, for when you want to go. So let's get over to the four questions that I'm going to ask for this giveaway. Here we go. So, question one. How many motor vehicles are on the DB Schenker 67 train? Question two. Name the layouts belonging to the three people in the selfie that I took. Number three. The fleet number of the train that I took to Chester. And number four. The liveries of the two Class 66s that are shown in some of the clips in my video. So right, there are the four questions. All the answers are either mentioned in the video or come up in a banner of text in the video. So um, good luck to you. So remember, everybody that uh, gets all those questions right will go into, into the hat. I will name the people when they, when and if they enter. I don't know how many people are going to watch this. And then uh, I will tell you what the prize is going to be and we'll draw uh, the winner out of the hat. So good luck to you.